Good morning guys, you are watching Aurora's vlog. Today's episode, I am going to show you how to use limit on Binance.com. So we are already on the main page. So for example, the reason for this is that when you use limit, you could actually pay for the lower price of the current price of any cryptocurrency. So for example, you do have Bitcoin and you want to buy XLM. To do that, right here on the upper right corner of your screen, click BTC. For this case, let's go and find XLM, which is a seller. So currently, XLM is 68 cents. Click on that. And on the bottom, this is where you are trading. Now, usually what I do, I click market because I want instantaneous. I want my XLM to be available right away. Currently, this is the trading price for the seller. So you click that. All right. We know that it is 68 cents. We just want to copy that and make sure it is the same on Google. So Google is 69 cents. But this is why seconds to seconds, minute by minute prices can be up and down, up and down. Now you want to say you want to buy 100 of it. If it is 68 cents for one token, that means you will have to pay $68 minus I think it's 1% fee for uh, the Binance. Now, the nice thing about the limit is that if Stellar is 68 cents, currently you want to say, I want to pay only 50 cents for that. You can actually do that because there is possibility that the prices can drop overnight while you were sleeping and you don't even have to be online to wait if the prices drops. You can just sleep on it and click buy and forget about it. So this is how you do it. You want to buy, let's say 500 of XLN and how much would that cost you if if the current price is 68 cents times 500, it will cost you $340. Now we are here, click limit. This is the current price, which is, let's go back here again, type it in. So 69 cents, right? You want to say, let's, oh, I just want to pay 50 cents for it. So you change the number here in the price. You make your own price, right? So right now, currently it's 4860 Satoshis. So let's say you wanna, you're guessing that it is 35 Satoshis per XLM. And then you want 500 of it, right? So uh, what is 3,500 Satoshis? That's it, right? 50 cents, okay? So you put that number, 3,500 Satoshis, how much would it, it would cost you? Let's go to our, instead of 340, 50 cents times 500, it would cost you $250 instead of $340. You are saving $90 for doing this. It's just hope that the price will drop overnight. And that's what I did last time. If we go back to my order history, see all the limit here. So I bought TNV fan xvg pro xlm and tronix this is what i did when i bought tnv i believe uh, what is 1000 to 2 cents i bought the tnv for 14 cents but it was actually 16 cents so it was like 12 or 13 satoshis like that or let's let's change that to 1300 yeah something like that it was the current price was which is 1300 satoshis and i write down 1000 satoshis within 24 hours i got the limit and it got filled it got triggered and i didn't even have to wait for it when i walk up everything is already there like oh so my open orders it got completely closed i got no open orders because it got triggered this is how nice if you know how to use limit you guys so this is how you can save instead of Instead of paying $340 market price for 500 amount of Stellar, you would only have to pay $250 for 500 amount. But the only downside of this is that you will have to wait if you want to buy lower than what it is asking. You have to do limit and your open orders it will have to sit maybe, maybe minutes, maybe hours, maybe days. Anyways, that's how you do it guys. Alright, so 
Thank you for watching Aurora's vlog. Please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!